how to include fonts in an angular project we can include fonts by directly linking cdn to our angular project or we can download the font files and host it in our own server we will be discussing how to implement these two approaches we will create a new angular project and we will download or get the cdn links from the google fonts website and include it in our angular project let's create a new angular project I will choose SESS. The Angular project is created. I will start the Angular project in development mode. This is the default boilerplate code that comes along with the Angular project. I will delete these codes and add an example that will be useful for our demo. As you can see I can I have added two div tags and we will be adding two different font families for this div tag. I will add these classes in styles.acss. Let's go to Google Fonts website. I will be proceeding with implementing the first approach here we can choose any fonts I will choose this font and here is the CDN link you can open index.html and you can add the links here here you can see we have pasted two links link rel equal to preconnect link href rel equal to preconnect this code line of code is added just to improve the download time of the font files this is optional and we need to add the font family so i will copy this code from here and I will add it in font one. Here you can see the our styles are added. I will choose another font family for our demo. Here I will choose the first option and I will copy the CDN link. And I have added it here. I have copied the font family and I have added it to font 2. Now let's see the output. So here you can see the content that is rendered as per the newly added font. Till now we have discussed how to add CDN links of different fonts. Now we will discuss how to download the font files and add it to our local server and serve it from our local server. I will comment these external CDN links. Now you can see the font styles got reverted back but it is not completely reverted because it is still uh, considering the font family that is uh, added here. So since the first font family is not available, 
it falls back to the second one so i have removed the fallback you can see the default font family is applied here you can go to the google fonts website and you can click download family to download the files of the corresponding font family we have downloaded the font family and if you go into the extracted content you will be able to see the ttf of files so this is the font file ttff is one of the file types for fonts the recommended browser file type for font is woff so we need to convert the ttf files to woff files we will make use of transfonter website to do this conversion i will add the downloaded fonts into this website you can add multiple files so i have added two ttf files and here you can see by default it outputs woff and woff2 woff2 is the compressed version of woff but woff is supported by most of the browsers that are available so we will we will only try to get the output of woff so the files are converted and i have clicked the download so i have downloaded the converted files now here you can see the transformed woff font files i have copied these two files and i will go to the assets folder in angular project and i have pasted these two files here here you can see the auto generated style sheet.css if you will open the file you can see these auto generated codes you can copy these codes and then paste it inside style styles.css and you can see that this file has reference to the generated woff files so you have to add the corresponding path here so corresponding path will be src slash assets slash fonts so i have added the uh, both the fonts into a angular project now you can see the font family gets rendered to our html content let's check if it is retrieved from our local host or cdn and it's being served from the local host server and this is another font file and it is being served from the local host server so while choosing fonts you should be aware of the size of the font file so here you can see the size of the font file is 837 kb you have to be aware of the size of the font file also as it will increase the download time of our front end project and also you can move this font face codes to a separate css file i 
have created underscore fonts.css inside fonts folder and I will refer it in styles.css. And still our code is working fine. Till now we have discussed how to include fonts in an Angular project either using CDN approach or by hosting the font files from our local server.